Hey everyone, I am going to Barnes and Noble and I'm also going to like this half price bookstore or something. First yeah, on the whatever. list, we are going to the half okay. price bookstore. things in here like a bookmark or something or a reading light or something like that you can put it in your bag or your suitcase or whatever and then it won't get damaged which is really smart because my books sometimes can get damaged and this was $11 but after the discount it was like how much nine. like $9 next thing I got was fold and stow book holder get it out when you get tired of holding your book and you put your book in there, oh whoops, there. You put your book in there, put it down, you can, if it's a bigger book, you extend it. If it's a smaller book, you go. I just realized I could put it inside of my book bag. And this book holder thing was $7. After the discount, it was probably 5 like five dollars after the discount. So at the half price bookstore I got quite a lot of um, books and some of them to be honest I probably did not need but I still got them anyways because they were half price. So I already have the Divergent books but I don't have them in hardcover. So here I have Divergent, Insurgent, and Allegiant. I already have four in hardcover so I didn't need that. The other version my mom, I sent her out to buy one of the books. Do you remember that? I was back before I really liked books. I was like, yeah, you can get me any editions. One of them is the movie edition. One of them is paperback and the other one is hardcover. So it was $28 for three of the books in hardcover. Like even on Amazon, you couldn't get that good of a deal and they're like brand new. Next book is My Life Next Door. This was only $5. It is paperback, but like, I didn't see any of them in hardback and once again it was just like why not i don't know much about it it's a teen ya romance so i think i'll like it a lot of people said it's like anna and the french kiss and i loved that series so i'm planning on reading it another one is matched they had it in box set but i didn't want to get the one in box set because a lot of people a lot of booktubers said they only liked the first book that but they didn't like the second and third book so I only got the first book because everyone said they liked this better. Next book I got was Rainbow, Rainbow Rowell's um, Carry On. I have two of her other books, Fangirl and Eleanor and Park. I don't know if he signed it himself or, there it is, or if it's a print. Oh, it's the Catastrophic History of You and Me. I don't know, like, is this going to be good? I feel like I've heard about it, or maybe I'm just like mixing it up with the different title. It looks like a really cheesy cover though. Some famous authors have written good reviews about it. At least it was only $9. Hopefully I will be going back tomorrow and getting some things at Target 
and some more cheap bookstores. But, um, yeah, I will not include that in this video. This lighting is so harsh. Ah, I am sweating, so I'm going to go inside and see you later. I can put it inside of my book bag. Inside of my book bag. Realized I can put it inside of my book bag. Let's try again.